Okay, so we had this nonprofit that was originally using an access database to track program enrollments that we migrated to the Salesforce nonprofit edition. So we could add a contact, and we have different types of contacts. Uh, we're only going to focus on the youth for right now. And then we're going to enroll our contact in a program. And now we're going to take a look at this program. So this program was already started, and that's why I chose it. It's already got uh, seven youths enrolled. And when the program is first created, it actually creates a program name based on these other fields. So we look here, we have seven youths enrolled in this program, and we could have more youths. In fact, most programs are probably going to have about 30 youths in them. And then for each day, we have a session. And each one of these sessions is going to have many attendances. So for every day we have a session, we want to track the attendances. And as you notice, though, when I saved that session, these attendances were added automatically via a trigger. That way we don't have to go and add all these seven youths every day. It just copies the list from the enrollments. And then from there, we can determine whether or not they were here today. And this editable visual force page is used. So after we refresh, we can see it updated on here. We also see the total pre present and the total possible, of the total possible and the session attendance percentage. We can also run reports on these programs to see the percentage of attendance for each date, as well as the average attendance for the entire program. Back on the program, we also have uh, outcomes. Uh, originally, they wanted to be able to add 20 questions for each form and keep track of the totals back from those outcomes. However, they didn't know what those questions were, so I gave them the ability to add those questions. And there are different types of forms, which we can then also run reports on to group those forms, their results, by each program and by each type. So what they would do is they would distribute a form to the youths. Those youths would fill it out, and then they would gather back the totals. So they would then turn around and put in for each question the question and the totals, and then could run reports on them. 